This is Jay Money with Fallen Forward Financial. Uh, just an update here on uh, Nano Dimension, uh, NNDM. As you follow my channel, I've uh, covered this one uh, quite a few times. This is uh, one of my favorites. Um, I can really uh, see the potential uh, behind this one. Um, so, like I said, I've uh, been in this one for a while. Um, it... Um, has just been uh, going down lately so I uh, don't know what's going on with this one uh, for sure uh, but you can see um, right about a year ago you could have got into it uh, for uh, 77 cents uh, under a dollar and then it kind of took off here something happened uh, that week of May and uh, just kind of went up and it's been kind of going up ever since then had a great run up here in uh, January and then uh, kind of came back down uh, pretty much a 50% uh, haircut there almost um, so I um, don't know what happened there they've been uh, raising a lot of cash uh, been doing some other things uh, I don't know if anybody knows what they're doing with that uh, cash for sure but um, I haven't come across anything yet uh, I guess maybe just have to be patient with this one maybe it's just uh, presenting a uh, buying opportunity but here even in the uh, last month uh, it's down quite a bit, eleven dollars, down about uh, four bucks. So last week been kind of up and down, and here's what it's doing today. So could have got the dip here at uh, six eighty one. So I guess maybe if you wanted to trade this one and uh, did it right, you could probably make some money on it. Uh, but um, um, as you can see, I still have my fifteen here in this account at uh, four thirty two. And I've had those for a while. Uh, feel free to pause and uh, go over the rest there for yourself. Uh, but basically, the big catalyst on this one is the uh, Dragonfly Pro system. Uh, it's uh, 3D printing, a pretty cool uh, company. And um, found in 2012, $1.92 billion market cap. And they do have uh, earnings coming up. Uh, so maybe uh, would be a buying opportunity not that I give tax legal or trading advice uh, but uh, maybe it is a buying opportunity and maybe it will go up maybe they'll have uh, good earnings so need to look into that a little bit more and probably do a um, update on it at a uh, later time um, but here's uh, where I bought mine back in October and November 452 and uh, 391 and just been kind of setting on them so um, but I'm long term on this one. I can see the uh, potential in it and um, probably won't be uh, selling mine anytime soon unless uh, something uh, drastically happens with the uh, company. So um, once I get some uh, more money to uh, put into this one, I'll probably be doing that. Uh, but right now it's going to uh, other places. Uh, this is dated on the uh, 7th, so kind of some older information, uh, but still relevant. That's only a week old, uh, but uh, NNDM announces uh, appointed as new president. Uh, I think it's ZV or Zivi Nedevi. ZV Nedevi, that's how I'm going to say it. Uh, doesn't matter. Uh, so an industry uh, leading additively uh, manufactured electronics, uh, printed electronics provider, uh, which is NNDM, announced today that uh, ZV Nedevi uh, has been appointed a president of Nano Dimension. As previously announced, Yeov Stern, the CEO of Nano Dimension, will be appointed as chairman of the board. And this just kind of goes over some information, uh, kind of goes over their resume, what they've been into uh, before, uh, world leader in uh, chemical lighting solutions, um, Chemiluminescent ammunition, that's uh, pretty interesting, that sounds fun. And infrared devices used by uh, U.S. and NATO military, so uh, I'd like to uh, have a couple of those to uh, shoot. <laughs> sounds like fun. Sounds like a fun guy, so. World leading developer, innovation, energy based technologies, so it looks like he's got uh, quite a. Um, list of uh, unique and uh, interesting uh, opportunities here. Uh, Kelstrom Industries, a supply chain of advanced data management company and a five-year period including uh, nine acquisitions. 
So maybe he'll bring some new flavor to the uh, company and uh, boost up the price. Uh, he was the F-15 fighter for seven years and held rank of major. Very cool. Sounds like a pretty interesting guy. Sounds like he's been into some really uh, interesting and uh, fun type of things. Uh, this is another one on the uh, 8th, how they appointed uh, Hannon Chino as Chief Product Officer and Head of Strategic M&A. This is just dated on the uh, 8th. For over 30 years, uh, Mr. Gino has a, a senior executive leading international technology corporation responsible for 1,200 employees and grew SI's revenue. Feel free to pause and uh, go over this uh, detail by detail. I'm just hitting the uh, highlights. Um, so the employees uh, and grew SI's revenue from 200 million to 400 million annually. Uh, so maybe you just need to have patience with this one. Uh, maybe this is an oven and not a microwave like a lot of people want it to be. Um, I feel over the uh, next five, ten years, over the next decade, these, um, I feel, should um, take off uh, the way technology is going and everything. Uh, but here you can see uh, more of what this particular individual has done. Um, Business from 265 million, including an acquisition of technology company in Silicon Valley. So they have quite a, a wide array of different activities that uh, both of these individuals have been into, and uh, maybe this will be a turnaround for the company. Uh, like I said, uh, maybe this is just uh, presenting a buying opportunity for all of us, um, but 15 years of experience as an executive. Officer management teams of So that's looks like they picked uh, two good individuals, uh, but Again, you can find those on uh, both of those articles on Yahoo Finance. Uh, this kind of goes over uh, Why the stock fell 12 point percent in uh, March uh, According to data S&P uh, Global market intelligence the stock lost some ground amid uh, broader pullback and growth dependent tech stocks last month so tech's been kind of up and down and uh, it kind of switches from tech to banks to um, it just kind of switches all around that's why I like to be diversified that's why I say it's good to be diversified uh, but not overly diversified but uh, whatever you have and make money and build out your positions in it um, but back to uh, NNDM uh, published its fourth quarter results on March Posting revenue of $1.97 billion in the period, uh, roughly in line with last year's performance. The company ended fiscal year with a $671 million in cash and bank deposits and has been raising money by selling stock. Uh, Nano Dimension now has a market capitalization of roughly $2.1 billion, up from its market cap roughly $5.9 million one year ago so maybe it's uh, growing pains they're just kind of trying to find out what to do with the cash and it's obviously they got something in mind um i wish i knew the uh, secret um, but i haven't found that yet maybe this classroom or whatever that was has the idea he was raising his hand <clears throat> So they got caught up in the broader pullback uh, for growth-dependent tech stocks last month. Uh, but it looks like the momentum is picking up at the business, and its shares price have risen uh, roughly 1,050% over the last year. Uh, so it's grown, but um, maybe it's growing pains. The stock has skyrocketed men increasingly favor outlook of the Dragonfly printing machines. Uh, which is being used in an additive manufacturing of semiconductors and other complex electronic components. Uh, so they're into some really uh, cool uh, technology here. Uh, that's why I like this company, and uh, that's why I'm just setting on my shares and going to uh, buy when I can. Um, should buy before it goes back up here, so... Uh, Maxim Group lifts Nano Dimension uh, price estimate. Who else is bullish? Uh, I'm bullish on it, uh, but like some other stocks, uh, this one uh, tends to uh, piss me off from time to time. 
Uh, so they lost 6.14% or minus 0.48% or points to close $7.34 with a heavy trading volume. Uh, so that is pretty heavy. The company reported on April 8th. Uh, so we'll see what they uh, do here the uh, rest of the month with the uh, two new individuals being added. Let's see if there's any other information in here. Uh, so this kind of goes over the individuals that they're adding. Kind of some information that we already went over. So... Feel free to pause and uh, go over the rest there for yourself. Um, but based on careful and fat-based analysis, Wall Street, the current current consensus on the price target of NNDM is uh, ten dollars per share. Analysts on a target price and performance of stocks is usually carefully studied by market experts. Stock is random recommendation set at two dollars the rating represents a strong buy recommendation on the scale of one to five five would meaning strong sell and so on so i think it's been at a buy strong buy for uh, quite some time And I think there's been some people that have traded this, and that's what's made the fluctuation. And uh, I had read at one point where they were shorting this one as well. So, and this one's been talked a lot. So I'm sure it went up, and um, people took profits. So that could be another thing as well. Fifty would represent a neutral market momentum. The current RSI for NNDM. Uh, last two week period is set at 35.17 so if you still have this one go ahead and leave it in the comments along with your uh, cost basis and uh, if you bought any more here lately on the uh, dip if you will and um, uh, once this next article comes up, this is going over a person that's uh, bought. So uh, two days ago, Kathy Wood bought over 680,000 shares. One of the ARK exchange traded funds run by uh, Kathy Wood uh, bought 680,000 shares of Nano shares on Tuesday as the price of the ETF gained about 1% on Tuesday. ETF is still up over 100% in the last year. The uh, ARC Autonomous Technology and Robotics, RC, or I'm sorry, R A R K Q. So, I did not hear that until just now. So, uh, there's a lot of people that follow Kathy, um, basically, follow every footstep she does, calls her the. Uh, Warren Buffett of today, so Warren Buffett's still around, he's still here in Omaha with me, but um, a lot of people are following uh, Kathy Wood, so which are integral enablers and autonomous intelligent drones, cars, satellites, smartphones, so this company has got to be huge it's got to be huge someday. It's, um, I mean, just as it says here, it's basically in everything. Some of these include, so if we back up here, as a provider of intelligent machines, some of you already know this, uh, which is a high fidelity active electronic and electromechanical sub assemblies, when integral enablers of autonomous intelligent drones, cars, satellites, smartphones, and vivo medical devices. So this. Uh, covers all the bases so uh, the stock just isn't uh, going up uh, like we want it so maybe you just need to be patient with this one uh, buy the dip when you can not that I'm telling you to but it's up to you and um, build out your position and I feel someday this is gonna take off so go over here and see what uh, stock twits has and check tip ranks here in just one moment uh, but like I said if you have this one uh, go ahead and leave it in the uh, comments and if there's any other uh, 3d uh, printing out there go ahead and leave that in the uh, comments as well so currently at 716 if 
you invest in Dogecoin, uh, I've already done a Doge video this week and it is up, so that's uh, cool to see. An NDM is a scam on plummeting from 15 to 7. Um, I've heard that before. Some say an NDM is a scam. Um, I don't agree. Threat me with a good time. Bullish. So everybody that I've uh, talked to on this one and uh, seen and watched. Um, there's other people talking about this one. Everybody's bullish on it. Three year hold, 1000 at 1098. Because you didn't get rich overnight. <laughs> Imagine whining on the board every day and being miserable because you didn't get rich overnight. Amateurs. <laughs> oh, gotta love it. So, like I said, you just gotta be <laughs> patient with this one and quit whining about it. And, um,. <laughs> Uh, maybe don't watch it as close and just set your alerts and buy the dip. I don't know. Company with a great technology, <laughs> it's management, especially CEO tra tragedy. So, well, maybe that's going to turn around with the uh, new one, or maybe he's talking about the new one. Who knows? I would not doubt 750 by the end of the day. So people are bullish on this, or else they're totally hating on it and bashing it. We are two cents higher than yesterday's to close. <laughs> uh, there's something that's got to be um, <laughs> green going on with this one. Last year's summer craze was EV. Winter was green energy. Now it is crypto. What's next? Can genomics, AI, robotics, 3D printing, or something new? And so I'm into these, so that's why I say to uh, diversify uh, green energy I have, uh, crypto, not a lot, genomics, uh, BNGO, if you follow my channel, robotics, 3D printing, it's it's a slow game. So just like that other comment says, just got to quit whining about it, I guess, and uh, hold. So, um, but I'm going to continue holding this one. We'll see what uh, happens with it. So I feel there's uh, great things, um, but um, maybe tip ranks doesn't feel there's great things. No recent analyst ratings. Wow. Well, um, but let's see. Well, there's nothing on Robin Hood either. Nobody wants to rate this one. They're afraid of it. So I don't know. But I'm going to continue holding mine. I'm still in the green. So, um, Again, here's kind of what it's done over the last three months and uh, had kind of a nice run up, but it, then it's running down. So if you haven't smashed that like button yet, go ahead and hit that for me as well as subscribing and hit that bell so you're notified of when the uh, next videos drop. And I'm going to continue to do some more uh, DD on uh, NNDM. If you have any uh, other info out there about uh, NNDM, that would be appreciative. And because uh, I know a lot of people watch this one, uh, but it's had a kind of a decent here, day here today. So, um, but I'm going to continue holding. So uh, if you haven't smashed that like button yet, go ahead and hit that for me and subscribe and hit the bell so you're notified of when the uh, next videos drop. Again, this is Jay Money following Ford Financial. Happy trading. Happy investing. Stay green. Cheers.